too much, or a bit too much. Do that there. Yeah. All right. How's it going, everyone? You want to learn how you can get a 16 by 9 anamorphic image out of your Sony camera? Let's find out. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to film in full frame mode. What that means is that you're going to have this really harsh vignetting all around the frame where the APS-C lens isn't actually projecting beyond that APS-C zone on a full frame sensor, but that's fine. Then what we're going to do is de-squeeze it in post. Now you can do this a number of ways. You can do it by setting a sequence at a 1.33 times aspect ratio if you want to, or a pixel aspect ratio, I should say. But I actually prefer doing it in the effects control window. I de-click the uniform scale so that I can control my scale width and height independently. And then I change the scale height from 100% down to 75.2% which is essentially a 1.33 times division on 100%. That will give me a 240 cinema aspect ratio or nearly a 240 cinema aspect ratio, which will give me an accurate de-squeezing of this anamorphic footage. Then the next step is to add the transform effect, which you'll find under distort in Premiere Pro's effects panel. And then in the transform effect, you're going to use the scale, which is going to scale it uniformly. So height and width together and scale that up and just keep scaling that up roughly to about 150% until the black bars have left the screen, you're no longer working with a 240 to one cinemascope aspect ratio. You should now be on an anamorphic 16 by nine aspect ratio, which will only incur a slight loss in quality. And in fact, won't incur any loss in quality if you're shooting in 4K and down sampling to 1080 for a deliverable. And that right there is a quick tutorial on how you can get a 16 by nine, 1.33 times anamorphic image from your Sony camera using a anamorphic lens like one of these Suray lenses. Cool. Give it a thumbs up if you liked what you saw. Hit that subscribe button and I'll see you next time. Cheers. A bit of flaring going on there. Mm, yeah, look at that. Nice, nice.